Do you like knowing exactly what you're going to get in your subscription box? Do you have a tight budget and need to make sure you know you're going to like your items? Well, a customizable box might just be the box for you. As you can see in this picture, this is what my FabFitFun subscription box looked like. It is a quarterly lifestyle box where you can customize lifestyle makeup, skincare, jewelry, you can whatever's in the category that depending on the spoilers, you can pick. You can pick if you're an annual member, you can pick all of your items. If you're a quarterly member, you can pick four out of your six categories of customization. So if this is what you like and you don't want a surprise but you want to customize, they do have mystery bundles available for that little surprise luxury. This might be the box for you. And stay tuned to the end of the video to see if I won this FabFitFun Scratcher. Shout out to Scratch and Pete PA. Thank you so much for your support on my channel. I can't wait to do a scratcher on my channel. This is super exciting. So if you want to see what I got in my summer Fat Fit Fun, then please stay tuned. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Jessie. If you're new here, I unbox subscription boxes and more. Today, as you can see, is the subscription box FabFitFun quarterly box. I just renewed my annual membership, so in addition to my summer box, you're going to see the amazing bundle that I got for renewing an annual membership that featured a item from Lily Pulitzer, and I can't wait to show you guys that. And we'll get into these categories, I would say, right away. Uh, why did I renew? FOMO? <laughs> Maybe, mostly. Um, I also miss getting full sizes of skincare products, although I do like picking lifestyle products when they fit my lifestyle, so these categories didn't really do it for me this summer, but we shall see what the fall brings, as we know very soon, if not the day you're seeing this video, or quite possibly during. So anyway, category one, I think a lot of us couldn't pass this up. I got the Elemis product. It's the Superfood Midnight Facial Moisturizing Sleep Creams. So I, um, it's 50 milliliters. I've never tried an Elemis product. I've gotten a couple, but I haven't been able to be, to use them. They weren't the types I could use. So I'm super excited to get into this, guys. This has a retail value of $50, which is, you know, this is why I get this box. As an annual member, it's you have to pay $220 up front, which puts it at $55 a box per quarter. Oh, that's beautiful. I'm not, it's like a dark pink, right? <laughs> I keep finding myself saying that about pink. It's what a channel will do to you, but... <laughs> Anyway, this is gorgeous. And then if you would like to go seasonally, that's $60 a quarter and you're only committing to the quarter, which maybe I should do because as you guys know, sometimes I'm not all that thrilled with the spoilers. Fingers are crossed for the fall. But I did the annual membership, so I can't wait to show you guys the bonus bundle. But in the meantime, this is a gorgeous product. Can I just say, I mean, the packaging, everything. Let me know, a lot of you I know had gotten it and I was expecting a safe seal. <laughs> it's possible I already took it off. I honestly can't remember. Um, I clearly didn't use it yet. Had a little bit of a cream scent to it, but with a moisturizer, if you're gonna use it on your face, you don't really want a cream anyway. But that looks really, really nice. Uh, usually I test, you guys know I test skincare products, but uh, <laughs> as you guys are gonna see, there's gonna be no way I can do that today in this video. I do apologize. That is simply gorgeous. In category two, another reason I picked this box, I couldn't pass up the First Aid Beauty brand. It's my first time getting a full size product of it. I've tried different uh, sample sizes in the Ipsy subscription, but I was never able to really afford a full size item. And that would be because the retail price for this one is usually $44. And that is a, not too bad, it's also 50 milliliters. This is the Ultra Repair Firming Collagen Cream. Uh, so I've never actually tried a collagen cream and I, I've heard people say that you really need to take collagen in supplement form 
to have it benefit your skin. I have, I can't speak to that at all. I definitely am not taking a collagen supplement at this point in my life, but here again is the beautiful packaging. I like First Aid Beauty a lot because they're known to have products designed for the sensitive skin, which I definitely have, and I definitely wanted to try a full-size product, and that does have the safety seal. I think I did it. I think I opened this. I feel like I did. Um, <laughs> I was super excited, as I am about all these products, but I want to make sure I don't open them all at once. You gotta be able to use them. They have beautiful packaging, both for glass jars. So already that is a huge, it's almost $100 worth of product just in the first two categories. So let's move right along. All right, for category three, I couldn't turn down the Juice Beauty, another brand I haven't gotten to try. And it looks like this is open from the bottom, but there we go. This is a stem cellular anti-wrinkle booster serum. It's called the Organic Solution. Again, this is a great brand and the retail value on this is $80. So I don't normally buy serums or use serums. Uh, I think if you've gotten my giveaways, you've probably <laughs> gotten an abundance of serums if you've won any. And this one I just decided to try because there was nothing really else in the category that I liked, and why not try an $80 serum, right? It has to be nice and good for the skin. So I'm just gonna go for it. I haven't tried it yet, but it's got really nice packaging and all that. You can see it's probably fairly shiny, <laughs> but if you guys let me know if we're box twins or if you picked any of the same items as me in the comments below, I would love to hear you know all of your feedback as normal. And category four, you guys, do you, what did you think I got? Anybody know? Well, I happened to get another skincare product. <laughs> it was just the way of it for me. It was, there just wasn't too many lifestyle items, but I, I kind of wanted to try a bunch of these brands. So I, I couldn't, especially these two, I just, I wanted to reactivate my membership. Uh, this is the Gloasis vegan probiotics and triple peptide refreshing eye cream with niacinamide and vitamin c and i believe this has a retail for 44 dollars so let's get this out and i will add up the, my total retail of the box and put it on the screen for you guys at the end trying to keep the prices as we go along of course then for my extra bundle that i got with lily pulitzer i'll have to look all that up after the fact I could have done it before, but it's, it's kind of nice to be surprised too. So anyway, this is beautiful packaging. It is, it does look small, but for eye cream, this will go a long way. Plus I have a lot of eye creams as it is, if I did not need it, but I thought, why not try a good, a good, good brand? And I'm, the, it's so tiny. There we go. It's 20 milliliters. The print was so small. Again, gorgeous packaging. Just lovely luxe brands here and if you're like me i know a lot of you get a lot of skincare but i i don't get really many any other skincare boxes at the moment other than the dionis goat milk skincare which i absolutely love honestly if there was a dionis product in five fit fun that i liked i probably would customize and choose it uh so there's my item for category four Category five, you guys, I got another skincare item. I know, I know, I know, but again, it was just what I saw in the category. Uh, this is the Laneige Water Bank Blue Hyaluronic Cream Moisturizer. It's a 20 milliliter size, and it is has a retail value of $23. So again, didn't really need it. More skincare, more moisturization, but I go through moisturizers, lotions, body lotions, hand lotions, moisturizers quite quickly. Uh, so at the same time, I am looking, always looking for favorites. And I love trying new brands. Like I said, this is a cost efficient way to do so. so again, very pretty packaging. Uh, I haven't opened, whoa, this is, this is cool. I haven't opened this one yet. Also safety seal. Uh, that had a cool opening there. Nice little packaging, it also looks like you have to get it straight to lock back on. 
so again I think some of you picked this I've seen this in some other boxes um, thank you guys if you're still here watching after you've seen so many FabFitFun unboxings but I'm gonna show you very soon got one more customization and then I'm gonna show you what I got in my uh, extra bundle that was including a Lily Pulitzer surprise <laughs> not prize item but you know what I mean any guesses for what I got in category six did I get more skincare if you want to stop and comment below and give me a timestamp you're more than welcome to guess and do so or if I'm tapping happening to premiere this you can say in the uh, premiere chat that's the live chat that you'll see if you attend a premiere but did I get skincare? There was a skincare item I liked in category six, believe it or not, but I didn't get it. <laughs> I thought with all this, I was well more than set. So I got this notebook, beautiful notebook by Studio O, as in O-H apostrophe. And this is gorgeous. I, I just love the colors. I, th I need another notebook like I need a hole in the head I mean especially the ones with lines I had some ideas for it but I don't know if it's gonna work quite as well as I had hoped uh, but it has a retail vice value of $22 and it is a hard cover which is awesome and it comes with 192 pages with six exposed die cut tabs which I'll show you and 32 page full color tabbed sections line dotted and graphed and uh, they also, um, it's a nine inch by 9.6 inches, which is interesting. I didn't realize how square it was. It doesn't look all that square when you're looking at it. Um, Cause I am kind of looking for a square. I am using a square notebook currently, but for my journaling, but anyway, long story short, <laughs> let me want to open this up and show it to you a little bit. It's just so pretty you guys. Uh, I love spiral bound. Look at this design. I'm loving colors. I think colors are in this season. But anyway, so you open it up. We have a tab of green lined paper. Um, I didn't realize that the pages themselves would be colored when I got it, but that's okay. Uh, but that was kind of what I was thinking. I could use this to journal, but I didn't know they'd be paid colored pages. So here's the grid, the dot grid. You probably can't even see it. Dot grids are usually very tiny. That would be like a great way to play that, uh, what's that pen the pig game or whatever that was where you make a square with all the dots. I wanted to practice dot grid, using dot grids for my journaling because I thought it might help me get something straight on the page. But it's looking like I'm gonna have to just do that if I get in a pink theme, which I, I kind of did, which is funny and then didn't use it but long story short it's okay and here is kind of more of like a graph paper style with the orange and then we go back and have the same three colors so this is awesome i'm not entirely sure what i'm going to use it for yet i do really like it uh it's just not exactly what i was expecting but i thought why not have a nice notebook and then i didn't realize this but Thankfully, after watching the Triple Crown um, FabFitFun collab with, uh, I think it was Reviews with Sue, I think it was Lara Wooten that mentioned that got the notebook and uh, the, the collab was also with Miss Jackie Russell. If you haven't seen those three channels, I highly recommend you guys check them out. I think the, uh, it depends when I post this, if they're if their giveaways are, in, are done at the time. But anyway, Lara posted out, a, pointed out that there were stickers in the back of the book which I didn't realize <laughs> when I opened so it looks like we've got whoa they're gold foils you may or may not have seen that I've it's come to my attention that gold foil stickers are very hard to see in my camera and I do apologize I'm not sure if I even held a lot of these products still enough I hope I did but this whole thing there's like this is schedule notes all these are checklists to do goals ideas plans travel meals reminder important I guess you could put these on the tabs if you want to ideas tab I actually I, I kind of like that idea uh, <laughs> put it on the ideas tab right that I like that idea to use this notebook and then there's some fun little gold foiled stickers at the bottom with some arrows and 
happy smiley frowny faces oh my gosh it's like a light bulb maybe that's for the ideas or hearts super cool so i'm really glad i watched laura's video and she pointed out stickers uh i always like stickers as <laughs> you guys know so i think out of all these items i spent the most time on the notebook what's this this looks like a oh it came with a pocket too guys i can put in more stickers <laughs> anyway so this is my five fit fun for summer 2023 here's the studio o if you wanted more information about it what did you guys think did i do did i pick some good items i i'm happy with my box despite the fact that it's a lot of skincare uh, let me know what your favorite item is in the comments below are we box twins did you are we category twins you know anything like that always love to hear it but i think now you guys want to see the bonus bundle mystery bonus bundle that i got with the lily pulitzer item so i'm going to magically clear this away and show you the bundle so i think at this point you're just going to laugh um <laughs> this isn't all of my bundle this is the first part but it's very similar to my box if in case you haven't noticed lots of skincare i kind of i definitely laugh when i opened it Again, it was a surprise. They said it was just an extra, you know, bonus gift to thank me for re renewing my annual subscription. And you know, guys, I didn't cancel and re-sign back up just to get this bundle. I'm not like that. I actually did take three quarters off of Fat Fit Fun because I was kind of getting tired of it. Wasn't sure what to pick anymore. Had to use up the products that I had. Uh, yeah, I will admit, one of the refill items that I get I missed greatly that may or may not have influenced my decision to come back but I'm gonna do refills and in, um, in another video so you guys will see that later but let's start out with a bundle we got a balance me I'm sure you guys if you've if you've gotten uh was this brand was this in Birchbox or Ipsy I'm now forgetting but a lot of you have probably seen this brand around and this is hey <laughs> wait for it wonder eye cream <laughs> I, I had to laugh. I mean, this is just like hyaluronic acid and witch hazel is in it for all skin types. It's 15 milliliters, and I haven't really opened or played with any of these. Um, obviously, going to use my more expensive eye cream first, but you know, I can't complain. Fat Fit Fun. I don't know if everyone got the same bundle who got these reactivation bundles. I forget what they called them. Let me know in the comments below if you got one of these you reactivated your annual membership it, what you got in your bundle because um i don't really know i haven't seen anybody unbox it yet uh and maybe i will have by the time i post this video but here we go so this is actually in a pump form this is interesting um anyway we're gonna move right along this one i wasn't too sure about it's uh the new co n-u-e and it's called the pill multi-action facial serum so as, as as i was saying i don't really use serums all that often i may put this in giveaway oh and if i can find retail values i will be putting them across the screen for you guys for these items um but i did have my account open and available so i could get the retail item values from the box here is this serum right here I don't know let me know if you guys have tried this brand or tried this serum got this serum it's really pretty packaging in the bottle um not opposed to it or anything i just don't really use that many of them now if it's a cream serum that would be easier for me so it just depends on the consistency uh a lot of them tend to be liquid and it's just a little messy for my situation but um we move right along this you're probably looking at is gorgeous packaging. I got way too excited for this. Uh, this is Winky Lux Lip Oil. Again, it's 3.8 milliliters. Beautiful, stunning packaging. It looks like something out of my journal, right? Uh, blue and gold foil. It's like, yes, please. Um, sorry, I'm trying to keep it open. And underneath, oh, wow. The packaging on this is snazzy. So this packaging, yeah, I wanted to get this out. This is stunning. It looks like it's got a little applicator inside to wear it. I'm not gonna open it yet. I, I've never used lip oil. Uh, have you guys used this brand or lip oil in general? 
Let me know what you think about it. This has got to be reflective. Uh, let me know if you like it. Um, I don't know if I'm going to like it or not. I have this feeling that I wouldn't. So you might see this in a future giveaway. Uh, not sure yet. But I will definitely not use it if I'm going to put it in the giveaway. And the next item is uh, Ahava, a very popular FabFitFun brand. Uh, let's see. Time to Hydrate, Essential Day Moisturizer for Combination Skin. Uh, so I've tried one of the Ahava Mineral. I think it was their hand lotion uh, formulation. Uh, this just seems to be like a daily moisturizer, which <laughs> I've got lots of. So again, not opening this yet. Um, so you guys are going to laugh even further. So to complete this bundle, my Lily Pulitzer item was... You ready? Do you want to do another time stamp and guess? Actually, for me, out of all the Lily Pulitzer items, it was probably the best thing I could have gotten. <laughs> another journal. I, it, it looks almost identical to my box, right? Just not as the brands aren't, the skincare brands aren't as, uh, you know, expensive. But look at this pretty journal. I probably would have put most other Lily Pulitzer things in a giveaway. Maybe not that um, ID wallet little case that a lot of you got. That looked kind of cool. I was kind of wishing I had gotten that. But... This is just stunning. It looks like coral in the ocean, doesn't it? And it's just nice spiral, hardbound, hard hardcover notebook, um, lined, if you can see. And yeah, no tabs in this, just pages. But hey, it's Lily Pulitzer. I have Lily Pulitzer stationery. Hey, and we got a retail vice, a price on the back. It says thirteen dollars and ninety five cents. Um, would I pay that for this? No, but it is beautiful. I mean, look, there's shells here, and it almost looks like that's just trying to be an octopus, <laughs> but it doesn't. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, it does have eight tentacles. Okay. A uh, bunch of coral. I, I love it. It's just so pretty. It's a beautiful take on oceans. Again, there's some more tentacles hiding out. Very, just very nice quality and very in trend this summer, I think. For sure, colors, bright colors are in trend. Fruits in trend. I'm loving it. So this is the bundle that I got. I'm definitely happy with all the items. Let me know if you would have liked this bundle, if you would have been disappointed if you read about the bundle and then got this. I didn't really know what to expect. I was, like I said, happy I got the journal. So, and I could certainly use most of this and if I decide not to use the lip oil or the serum, I have many happy subscribers out there who will take it in it, I'm sure. So, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me as I unbox my summer FabFitFun box and the additional reactivation annual membership bundle. If you haven't already, please give this video a like. It helps me and it helps my channel. And I do hope that you consider hitting that subscribe button if you haven't already. You're going to see a wide variety of content on my channel including skincare and journaling and stationary items, as well as lots of jewelry, science, educational, you name it, it's coming to my channel. So anyway, guys, until next time, I'll catch you later. But wait, there's more. <laughs> you guys remember, I said stay tuned to the end to see if I win anything. So we're going to scratch that now. I would like, I am going to try to find a way to do it on camera. I really am, but unfortunately the, right now my camera is connected to the table. So you guys can probably just tell if I start, you know, scratching it like I really want to do on camera, it's going to shake the entire camera way too much. So I'm going to try to figure out a way to film it. If not, I will show you the card at the end. But anyway, thank you guys so much again. Any channels that I mentioned in this video will also be linked in the description box. And until next time, guys, catch you later. Bye.